Hello and welcome back to Choice Bits of Bliss. My name is Scylla. In today's video, we are doing month two of Tool Time Tuesday. And this month, we are focusing on our sewing machines or sewing in general. So I will insert a photo here of my lovely sewing machine. She is over 20 years old and I used her almost never. I made some curtains one time. I think, I think that's all I did. <laughs> since I got, got the sewing machine. I, I just did not sew. And it sat and sat and gathered dust and I've moved it from location to, you know, different rooms in the house, different closets, different, you know, I just tried to, I just, I knew I needed to keep it, but I did not use it. <laughs> and I felt ashamed because I have masterful seamstresses in my in my family that gene did not land in my gene pool it just did not so then I packed it up because I you know I was going to move north and of course I had to keep my sewing machine <laughs> oh and I I moved it north and decided you know what? Sewing is becoming very popular on layouts. Maybe that is the thing. Maybe that is the, the thing that this sewing machine was destined for. And guess what? I sew more on paper than I ever have on fabric. True story. So I actually enjoy how it looks. I love the texture. <laughs> It is crazy. It makes no sense. But you, hey, this is this is what we have when you are friends with me. <laughs> so I'm really excited that we're focusing on it this month because I enjoy it now. I enjoy sewing on paper. So there we have it. I have my scheme kind of already laid out. I've actually done my sewing already. And this is these are my photos I gutted the blue cardstock so there it's all gutted and I'm going to layer this cardstock on top I refuse to say what color I think that is because I'm probably going to get it wrong and then we're going to lay this one. And I want to do something to the edges of this paper. This is a Vicki Booten foundation paper. And I'm going to use this one to do some die cutting because we're going to have some snowflakes and things on here that I will also sew. Now, this design, is all of this is done for me. But I wanted to stitch inside this gold uh, lazy circle because it's it's not... Is that showing up, the stitching? Maybe if I did it on the back, does that show up better? There we go. You can see, you know, it's it's a wonky circle. You don't have to be exact and perfect and make it perfectly round. This was meant to be in my life because nothing in my life is perfect, much less a circle. So it's very wonky and it's going to go in here. So this is where we're heading. And like I said, I want to do something to the edges. I'm going to do some inking, maybe some roughing it up. I don't want it to sit flat. I want it to have some dimension to it. It's probably the best descriptor. But I don't want to put foam um, adhesive or anything like that under it. But I do want to have it to have some some body to it, some body. <laughs> so these are my photos of my goofy puppies playing in the snow. And this one, she's our youngest one. This is Charlie. She's a stinker. 
and our oldest one, Kayla. <sighs> she just wants to be away from Charlie sometimes, and Charlie does not really allow for that. She doesn't allow for alone time. So Charlie is constantly messing with Kayla, and Kayla is desperately wanting her own space. So we are going to use this to die cut. I mentioned that earlier. I'm going to die cut some snowflakes out of this, and I'll probably grab some white cardstock, and I'm going to be doing clusters with snowflakes. So we're going to pause, and I will be right back. Okay, I've gone a little bit further than I said I was going to go, but I have stitched across these clusters and I've adhered my photos. I also gutted this paper because I decided once I started laying the snowflakes down, it needed that third color because it was replicate, you know, it's, it's replicating what's in the background. And I just love it so much better. Then I found these wood veneer buttons that I thought, you know what, that brings in the yellow and I love it. So what I'm going to do is hand stitch. I'm going to put thread through the buttons and I'm not going to adhere it down because these are not adhered down. The only thing that's keeping them on the paper is the fact that I've stitched it. So let me get that done and I'll be right back. Okay, I am back. Oopsie, give me one second. I am listening to my friend Donna. Her channel is Scrapping in the Sticks. And she is doing a video about Pink Fresh Friday. So I was listening to her as I was doing my stitching and I forgot to turn the volume down. Okay, I'm back. Nothing has been adhered. It, actually, nothing has been adhered except for these photos. <laughs> Everything has been stitched on. And I am loving the texture. I'm loving it. So there's that. Okay, the rest... I'm going to do with you because it's just sticking this stuff onto the layer down below it and it'll be all just fine that doesn't take that long and we can chat while we do that I am getting ready for um, 30 days of sketches in March and I'm wondering if y'all are interested in seeing the kits I have, good Lord, uh, that I have put together to get ready. If that's something that you're interested in watching, I have a container that has all of my kits in it. And I've cleaned it up a little bit because I think this is my fourth time playing, third or fourth time. And I've used some of the kits over and over again. I don't want to play with them any. I just don't want to play with them right now. It's not that they're bad kits. I just don't want to play with them. Yeah, I don't need to put any in the center because there's nothing in the center. So we're going to put this down. And I had said I wanted to do something around the edge. And I think uh, the lazies have gotten hold of me. And I don't. I don't want to do anything to the edge. <laughs> I'm done. Okay. I really like this layout. I hope you come back and follow everyone as they work through the month for Tool Time Tuesday, showing their examples of stitching, sewing machine, ERI type stuff, sewing. And um, I think I've been a little goofy in this video and I am sorry but it's Friday and thank God it's Friday <laughs> I'm so happy it's Friday all right come back again soon and we will chat some more bye-bye mm -hmm.